Japan's Olympic gymnastics captain sent home for smoking. Here's a summary of the article. The star of Japan's women's artistic gymnastics team has been sent home from the final training camp ahead of the Paris Olympic Games for smoking. Shoko Miyata, the 19 year old captain of the team, was missing from training on Wednesday, although Japanese Olympic officials would only confirm to reporters that she was absent for certain reasons. According to Japanese media reports, Ms. Miyata has left the team's training base in Monaco after she was seen smoking, in violation of the team's code of conduct. Her departure casts a shadow over the team's chances of winning a medal at the Games, which opens in the French capital on Friday. The last time Japan's women won a team medal for gymnastics was when Tokyo hosted the Olympics in 1964. Despite only being 19, Ms. Miyata was the oldest and most experienced member of a five-strong team that has undergone a complete overhaul since the delayed Tokyo 2020 Olympics, where the women's team came a disappointing fifth. Some on social media have pointed out that Ms. Miata had violated the team's code of conduct and broken the law so her expulsion was unavoidable. This post received a score of 6,800, with an upvote ratio of 95%. Here are the top comments in response to this article. Smoking and underage drinking. But they did it in Monaco where she wouldn't be underage. The Telegraph reports. The star of Japan's women's artistic gymnastics team has been sent home from the final training camp ahead of the smoking. Shoko Miyata, the 19-year-old captain of the team, was missing from training on Wednesday, although only confirmed to reporters that she was absent for certain reasons. According to Japanese media reports, Ms. Miyata has left the team's training base in Monaco after being seen smoking, in violation of the team's code of conduct. The last time Japan's women won a team medal for gymnastics was when Tokyo hosted the Olympics in 1964. So basically she was sent home for violating team code of conduct. Not criminal except only that the Japanese do not allow it, and the prohibition is also reflected in the code of conduct. No legal ramifications, just team discipline. I'm sure there have been US kids tossed off school or college teams for conduct violations from time to time. Just team discipline and having to answer to her family when she returns. The society she's going back home to puts a huge emphasis on following the rules and not shaming the collective population, and she did it on an international platform. I can't imagine what kind of backlash this woman will receive. I'm sure she will bounce back eventually, but I really don't envy the attitude she's going to have to endure from people when she gets back. Funnily enough is that no one cares if a 19 yo was smoking or not, do the Japanese think the rest of the world cares if she's smoking or not? We don't. This is a case where bending the rules just a bit and giving her a quiet pep talk would not have put this light on the Japanese delegation and saved the country's image. Now I see Japan as a country too rule obsessed, to the point of trying to bench an Olympic athlete for something inconsequential. Japan doesn't GAF what foreigners think lol. Unless it's for that tourism mula. I don't know, they seem to get a bit huffy when they're repeatedly accused of being war crime apologists to the very day by people from every country that fought them in World War II who otherwise can't agree on literally anything. Important to note that it was Japan's decision, not the Olympic Committee. It was against the team's code of conduct. Code of conducts exist for a reason, but a first offense warning was probably all they needed. Japan is also not replacing her on the team leaving their team a member short. Probably because the IOC wouldn't see it as a justifiable reason to boot her from the team. So the rest of the girls suffer. This video was automatically created by Reddit to speech. The article and comments in this video were selected from Reddit according to their upvotes, and any paraphrasing was performed by smmry.com, without any human intervention.